What if all of us in the world discovered that we were threatened by an outer a power from outer space? My name is Larry Bud Joe Farmington. I'm here to speak about a serious issue, alien abductions in the United States of America. I'm a psychiatrist in the southern portion of the country. Now, this is becoming a real problem here. Just to sum it all up for you, I'm gonna tell you point blank what we got here, the situation. We got blue-gray aliens, I call them Spielbergs. We got big bug-looking aliens, I call them basketball players. And then we got the basic alien, about six foot six, got one claw hand. Shit's fruit salad, we call him your claw man. Now, these abductions have been going on in the United States of America for, well, too damn long as far as I'm concerned. I've reviewed well over 15 cases, and these sons of bitches are just flying around the galaxy fucking the living hell out of everything they come in contact. Scientifically fucking them, not physically fucking them. That is to say, they don't mount people proper like a bull would. They just scientifically fuck them, and, well, they just gallivant on off, and then they come back and take fetus when they get good and goddamn ready. Yeah, I've had about enough of this shit. I think it's time for the government to quit hiding these secrets. Come on out with the truth. If I see one of these little blue sons of bitches in my yard, I got a rim to 12 gauge, and I'll tell you right now, partner, I will just blow his melon ass head right all over the goddamn yard. The government come out and scrape up that popcorn Spielberg alien, as far as I'm concerned. Now, they try to deny it and say that, say that uh, you know, it's all, it's all myth and hoax and swamp gas and shit like that. Well, I'm here to tell you firsthand, that's just a bargain lie. These aliens are just coming in and doing what they please whenever they want, especially them little blue-gray sons of bitches. Them ones raising all the hell. Now, I got about 15 complaints downtown on a daily basis. Now, the government says that the reason we have children in our town that glow in the dark is because we live next to a nuclear power facility. Well, I don't know. Sounds a little bit funny to me. Wouldn't you say so, brother? Another thing is, they ain't only females these sons of bitches are preying on. We have men in the town that are being abducted, and they are having semen involuntarily taken from them. Now, you go down to your regular old Kentucky man, you ask him how he feels about a blue-gray four-foot son of a bitch involuntarily taking his semen, and I will tell you, brother, he will not be delighted about it. It's embarrassing. These boys, these good old boys get abducted. They're laying there flat-ass naked, big old white beer gut hanging out, pecker flopping around, and they get a probe stuck up her anus. Well, I think it's high time the government come out with the truth. These little sons of bitches come around impregnating our women. Uh, they're hoe chasers. These aliens, I'm telling you, they're damn hoe chasers. They're going to go to Kentucky, man, and voluntarily take a semen? Well, you got yourself a little cocksucker on your hands there. These little cocksuckers invading our territory, and here's the way we feel about it. Uh, alien, please go away, you little fuckers. Aliens, go away, you little blue sons of bitches. Aliens, your home wreckers, quit sucking our farmers, peckers. Aliens, your home wreckers, sucking all our farmers, peckers. They don't want you to involuntarily take their uh, semen. They don't like all that shit that you're uh, doing. You stop sucking our farmers, peckers, you little uh, gray sons of bitches.